Well, hello there, friends, and welcome to my video. I am Mickey B. Have we met? If not, it's nice to meet you. And if we have, you know, it's always good to see you again. I'm here today with another Timu haul. It's about that time. I've got several items that I'd like to share, and I want to jump right into it because I don't know how long this video is going to be. I don't want it to be too long, but I do have a lot I want to try and get, um, out to you and share with you guys today so without further ado let's jump right into it but let me just say really quickly you know Timu is an online marketplace where several sellers sell several products you search you check Timu first when you're looking for something and see if they have a price that's less than what you would pay elsewhere before you go elsewhere because nine times out of ten Timu is going to be the best deal. Um, the prices are normally one half to one third to one quarter of what you would normally pay outside. And if you find that that's not the case, then I would be shocked. It does happen, but nine times out of ten, Timu is really going to give you a run for your money. And that means saving money. I do have a discount code for any of the items that you will see in this video should you choose to purchase them. And it is OPT43129. All the links to everything that I see in the video, unless it is sold out or no longer available, will be provided in the description box and in the first pinned comment. Having said all of that, I think I can go ahead and start now. So let's go and check out these great items that I have to share with you today. And I forgot to mention, everything I'm wearing today pretty much is Timu. This is from Timu. This is from Timu. This is from Timu. These are from Timu. The rings are from Timu. And so is the bracelet. All right. Now, here's the first let's see where's the adverse side so here this one's not a big one let's see what's in here because I've got these orders stacking up behind me and I'm forgetting myself what I've ordered and what's in these bags so let's see is there anything else okay so that's empty let's get started I feel like every day is Christmas oh, okay so this item right here this first item, this is a item for working out. You guys know I do my little mini stepper. And this item is a vest that I got to go along with those sauna pans that allow you to sweat. So it's got this uh, material inside, this vinyl material inside. And then it's a vest that you put on so you can get a real good sweaty workout you know get those thermogenics going on and get that weight to disappear I got this in a size uh, XXL everything I order is an extra large when I order shirts or pants that's just my standard size so that's what this is um, and I haven't worn it yet but I do have the pants and I have tried those pants and those things are amazing. I, I mean, I feel like I just got out of the shower when I take those things off. I wear them for about 30 minutes on the stepper. And I'm telling you the moisture that comes out of your body, of my body. Because I'm not a sweater. I don't really sweat a lot. But those, pants, those things really work. This next item also goes along with that. And it is a shirt. So it's a sauna shirt. Let's see if I got it all in frame. And again, same material. So I really want to make sure. Now, of course, I wouldn't wear these at the same time. I'd wear them separately. But I got the vest moving closer towards uh, summertime because it's probably going to be too hot to do a full one. And then I got this one to wear for now to go with the sauna pants that I have. And again, this is a XXL. I get everything in an extra large. I haven't tried either of these on yet. Um, but the pants I got were extra large and they fit. But I'll tell you, you really got to work your way into them things because it's not like regular fabric. Well, at least for me, it's not like regular fabric that just slides on, you know, so I have to cinch them up 
and they fit but I gotta cinch them up because I don't want to rip anything either because it doesn't just slide against your skin like that I guess if I had a super huge pair it would but for the purposes of them like being my size it doesn't you know I gotta work into them for lack of a better phrase this next item let's see what's in here I'm gonna try and keep this moving rather quickly um, I got a couple of these uh, cleaning brushes scrubby brushes with the handle on it this just makes life easier when having to clean the shower or the bathtub surround and the bathtub having a brush or a scrubby with some abrasiveness and a handle I just like things like this and that are also semi gentle what's interesting is this yellow part here is like a sponge that you'll never get to <laughs> And then this part is abrasive, but I like the abrasive ones to go with the cleanser just to get a good clean in my bathtub. So they were such a reasonable price. I went ahead and got two of these. So let's see what's in this third bag. I'm going to try to cut the chit chitty chat down unless I'm stalling in between, you know, opening and closing items. I did just do a Dollar Tree haul, so and I look like this, so you can't miss it. So check that out. I got some really great items in that haul that I've shared with you guys. Um, so in this container, I got a few more uh, cleaning items. These are sponges that, let's just open this up and see what they are like. You can never have too many cleaning items. You know, you eventually throw them away over time. These are for the kitchen. Now this does have a spongy side and then it has this abrasive side as well. I don't really care too much for the spongy part on any of the cleaning items, but it's this part that I really like. And this again is for the kitchen because it doesn't have a handle and this is something that's more practical for me to use in the kitchen because it does not have a handle. But for cleaning the shower and you know the stuff where you got to kind of bend down and lean into it definitely want handles on those so that's what these are I got one two three so five came in this package and um, you know these are definitely things that you want to keep on hand when cleaning because you got to change them regularly now this little item I was excited about this one I think it's really cute and what it is it's this little hand purse or hand wallet it's got the faux snake skin look or alligator skin whatever skin that is and then it has the two zippers I thought this was great for just running out of the house and you don't need a full wallet you just unzip I like how it's double sided so one side has has a little carry uh, wrist strap on one side it has the two slots like that and then on the other side it has multiple slots for like credit cards and I guess any you know just basically for cards I suppose and um, and then you take this little wristlet right here stretch it out a bit for you and it pops on I guess it just pops on one of the the zipper pulls I'm guessing I don't see a oh yes I do I think there's a no is there a special slot oh there's okay the it's this right here so you want to attach this right here into this hole and then that's how you carry it see if I can get it in here for you it's a little hard I guess I gotta go the opposite way like this okay there we go so that's what it looks like with the wrist strap on it and you just let that loosen up a little bit to get the crinklies out but I thought this was so very cute and it has enough room you know for cash and change on that side where it just had the two spots right here you can put a little bit of change and some cash here and then the card so I think this is great you know just to run out and take care of something and run back home it would be great for a little kid or a teen as well because they don't normally have much stuff in the way of ID and cash and all that. Little school ID, you know, little fun stuff. But, you know, for the mature people who have bills <laughs> and have to carry a little bit more, that's great to just run in and out of the house. 
so that's this first little order so let me go ahead and grab another one and keep this going okay this order right here I just actually received today so let's go ahead and hop into this one and this one starts off with oh let me show you how big it just another envelope nothing too hefty um so we're gonna start off with this little deal right here and this is let's see this is one of those squeegee cleaners that you put some like window or some cleanser in here what did we say you did it you put some window cleaner in here this unscrews oh yeah it does unscrew there oh and then it looks like it unscrews here at the bottom I think or is it here at the top it's here at the top so this is where you would put in your Windex or all-purpose cleaner and then this just turns so that doesn't come off and then you would screw it back into here so this will be great to like keep in your car and then let's see here so you want to twirl that to where the the spray is facing that way so you squirt your window like that and then you clean it and then you would squeegee it all in one so I thought that was pretty cool this probably would also be good for like a shower door cleaning that if you have one of those glass shower doors um, keep it in your car for your car windshield what else could you use this for I'm sure you guys could think of other things but I thought this was great um, it was a lightning deal I'm pretty sure so I definitely will be using that this I got for the pool because it is the season for how do I open this oh I thought it was open it's the season you know spring and summer it's time to get on top of my pool care and the one that I have now it's been out there for a few years these things don't last forever so you do have to replace them from time to time so I figure this is a pretty good deal now it's not the same heavy duty um, materials used in the one that I have now but price wise it's a good deal for the price it's a good size and I have an in-ground pool so I need a big one and this is I was surprised to see how big it was I'm pleasantly surprised because this is what I was hoping for you know normally with Timu things are much smaller than they appear when you order them but this one is a perfect size it is not as sturdy as what I have now but what I have now has a hole in it and needs to be replaced so I'm hoping that this is gonna last you know a couple of seasons anything for the pool once you leave it out and that those chemicals and all that stuff it wears it down anyway so you do have to you know replace them from time to time so it's to be expected and for the price of this you know I figured I'd take a chance on it before I go and pay probably four or five times the amount to get a, you know another a sturdier one um, what do I have here oh this is this bag is let's see if I can take this out because it's playing with me okay so this item right here this is something that I bought for Jenea and she loved it I knew it was perfect for her and I knew that she would like it and it is a nice color too and it's a t-shirt specifically for her even though it looks like a t-shirt it really feels like the material you can kind of see it I think it's like that real it's smooth what would normally be it's kind of like um it's definitely not a t-shirt material and it's not even like this material that I'm wearing it kind of feels like a jersey or something it's really weird but I'm sure it says 100% polyester of course um, and it's an extra extra large um, but it says can you see that because I can't see I'm just gonna hold it up and hope that I'm getting it and it says and this is so true for her what does it say gaming 
makes me happy you not so much I showed her this shirt she fell in love with it and she tried it on and wanted to wear it probably today and I'm like well I need it back so I can at least haul it so she tried it on and didn't want to take it off so I forced her to take it off and I said I will haul it today so you can get it back today so I got that for her and when I tell you this chick loves gaming it is no joke she's doing it all the time wee hours of the night after getting off work I've never seen a chick like gaming so much but that's her thing so when I saw that I had to get it now this is what I was talking about when I said I was pleasantly surprised at the net for the pool because I ordered these for the chlorine tablet and the tablets are not as big as this top but pretty pretty a good size it's close to maybe like around here the, the uh, chlorine tablets are about this big and you take this off <laughs> and you're supposed to drop the chlorine tablet in here however do you see how small this is so on the uh, website they totally did not look like they were going to be this tiny so because they're so small and I, ha I have two of these in my pool so I got two of them because I have two now that need to be replaced because they're old they're all beat up and everything and I said oh I'll just get these two from Timu so what's gonna have to happen now is instead of me just dropping the chlorine tablet because it looks like you know just like a, a hockey puck you know it's round and it's thick and you drop them in here but now I'm gonna have to break it up to fit in this little tiny hole <laughs> and let it float around because the ones that I have now um, they look like this but this part down here is about as wide as this to allow you to just drop the tablet in there so I had to laugh when I opened these and I always tell you guys make sure you measure before you order and I have to laugh because I didn't take my own advice and then I got and I don't even know if they had measurements on there but I, I didn't even check because the picture just really looked so convincing I didn't think that they would even make anything this small I figured this is probably for above the ground pools or maybe like a jacuzzi or something because it's so tiny but not for an in ground pool but I'm gonna use them since I got them along those lines this is a small vacuum cleaner for the car or that's kind of how it was advertised when I got it now I haven't opened this up yet but you see how small this box is look at my hand and look at the box and I'm thinking I'm getting a vacuum cleaner size car you know a car size vacuum cleaner but when you look at the pictures and of course I'm, I have pictures you know like I always do I always include them as I'm showing the items and you tell me if you think this looks like you know um, looks bigger anyway so look at how tiny this is so I imagine this is good for little crevices and things but it's not what I thought it was going to be size wise and so this is how tiny this thing is is it even on it looks like you charge it so that's good there's no batteries Ooh. okay I feel like this little bad boy got some power behind it though let's see how does it go on okay okay it might pick up a little something honey get back go back and he likes to come under the I think this scared her okay it does feel like uh, let me just okay calm down Mickey calm down it comes with instructions or yeah it looks like little instructions or something to that effect and then it also has a little cable and then it has these cute little attachments I don't know what this is for this might be something that goes in here I have to read the instructions first but oops but like because how does this fit in there this is long oh you know what I get it, it probably goes like this yeah 
So this goes on this end. And this goes here. Now when I do that, I don't really feel anything. But let's see if I take that off. It doesn't feel as strong when I do it this way so I don't know maybe just for a little spills or something or maybe around your desk it's certainly cute and small kind of looks like little doll <laughs> little doll furniture or equipment so and this is the little filter inside of it but we'll see how it works out it felt strong though like when I did it this way See, that feels strong and the other thing is this side it blows stuff so if you have something you want to scatter around you blow it on this end and then you want to suck something up you do it on this end so it was like a that's why it's called a two-in-one vacuum because it sucks and it blows so we'll see how it pans out it feels like it has power just on its own like this but I don't know about for a car and then even if you were trying to clean out a car how much are you going to really fit in this so it's for little small steals you know common sense is showing that it's just for little small spills and small things to uh, clean up so let's move that over here out the way and then move on to the next items let's move these two all right so what else do we got oh i got this <laughs> for Janaea too because <clears throat> excuse me she thinks that she lives at a hotel and i need to redirect her thought process <laughs> and i saw this and i thought it was perfect so it comes with a little string to hang it a little twine and then it says this is a self-cleaning kitchen clean up after yourself perfect because i'm always telling her you know you left this or you left that or you didn't do this so i need something to reiterate those rules that she can see and probably still try to ignore what is that okay i don't know that looked like a spider or something you know i don't play that so yeah, it just goes right here. You tie the knot. Shh. Honey. 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 Tie it. Alright, so let me see. I'm just going to tie it real quick like right here. And then on this side. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it in the kitchen. Honey, be quiet please. That's enough. I think honey's like it's past my dinner time because Janaea feeds her when she gets home. Okay, so isn't that cute? I think I should put this on her chair <laughs> at the dinner table. But yeah, I thought it was so cute. It's nice and thin. And but it is wood. It feels like just a thin little piece of wood. So but with a very powerful message that I support. I support this message. So that was fun. And then I got, uh, these were at a great price. Again, more cleaning um, sponges. So I got one, two, three, four. This one's kind of open or something. And five. And I think all of these, five times four, so it was 20 sponges. Um, probably cost me a little over a buck or a dollar so it's definitely a stock up price and then they had these initials and I got an M and a B now when I ordered these I actually thought that they were silly me but I thought that they were um, metal I didn't think that they were foam and these apparently appear if I can pull it out why is it sticking 
Okay, there we go. So it has this like a frosted looking thing and then it has this. So I guess that it's only let's see, does this peel off on the back? Okay. Okay, this I think this peels off on the back that allows you to put it here on top of the foam because that's how it was in the package. And then once you adhere it to this like that, then you can turn around and take this off and stick it wherever you're going to put it. I believe that's how this works. Let me just see if this peels off a little bit. Yeah, it definitely has a layer of paper that I believe comes off. It feels like it for sure. I'm trying to see if I can get one corner lifted and confirm that. I feel like I can. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, it's kind of lifting over there in this little corner. I don't know if you can see it. But that's how this works. So just FYI. There we go. See how it's lifted right there. So it does peel off here. So I guess they did this maybe one of two ways if you just wanted to use this part this thin part it's kind of plastic I think and then maybe if you just wanted this sponge part by itself maybe you have two options to do it separate or you can put this on top so yeah I get that's how I'm looking at it anyways and you know for the price I don't know what I was thinking but I also didn't think it was going to be this thick I thought it was going to be something more, like I said, more thin and like a thin piece of metal. Like that's how it looked to me in the picture. But, you know, if I wanted that, I can still use that top one in that regard if I just wanted something thin. And then here's the B. Like that. That's what the B looks like. Ooh. Like that. So yeah, not bad. I mean, it's it's still flexible. Then the last item in this order is or are these little cord keepers. So you stick this on something like an appliance and it velcros. So if you want to wrap your cord around it, you just wrap your cord around this part and then fold it up and velcro it instead of those other plastic things that they used to have this is just something more simple it's velcro and then you just bend it up like that and then on the back it's adhesive so you peel that wherever whatever appliance you want to stick on I thought this was less invasive than those plastic ones and you get I think you get five in here let's see you get enough to to uh, you know address oh look at you get one is this two or one? Oh yeah these, these are two stuck okay so you get one two three four five six wow seven eight you get ten of these I don't even remember how much these cost but that's a good deal I'm sure the price is on the screen but 10 of these so if you have 10 appliances in your kitchen you can knock 10 appliance cords out and you don't have to worry about um, uh, like if it's flat or not because this is more fabricy, and you can stick it on like a curved surface those other ones because they're more plastic if it's a round surface it might not be you know, it might be too rigid to really conform to it, like if you had something that curved like that. Whereas these, because they're fabric, they'll curve and then you just Velcro it up. So I like these, this idea a lot better. I haven't even used it, but I can tell I'm going to like these better than those other ones. And I do have some of those other ones. I just have never hauled them yet. But I, when I saw these, I'm like, these I definitely know I can use and they'll be more universal on my appliances. All right, this next package or this next order looks like this. OK, 
kind of how big that one is and this was some goodies in this one too so we're gonna start off with well, let's pull these out because these are the big ticket items it's not that many so let me sit that there and then so these were a great price I got two of these let me sit them here and then let's pull this one out okay so that's all that's in the bag so the these two items right here they're the same and they are this they are uh, laundry baskets or that's what I got them for to put your dirty laundry in So they are back these containers. Oh. Oh, okay. I was going to say, I thought they were square. They are. Okay. So they're pretty big size. And let me just try to open it up for you a little bit. Alright. So you get the gist of how big this is. I'm hoping. And then it's tall. And it's going to hold a lot of laundry. And then it has the straps at the top here. Nice long straps to carry it with. Like that. Here's what I found. My watch thinking I'm talking to it. And yeah, this is going to hold a lot of laundry. And these were... <laughs> When I saw the price for these, I'm like, I have to get them. Because I had ordered one prior to this. And I thought, you know, I want to make a set like whites, darks, and colors. I think that's the normal. Or delicates. Wait. Light, dark, and delicates. I think those are the three different sections. So I'm going to take these and clip them together. And then label them excuse me I can use the labels that I just bought wait that I just hauled from the Dollar Tree it was a pack of three and it was four bins and you just clip it on so I can label these with those because there's another one in another order that I ordered I believe it's the same design and same style but these are huge you can get a lot of laundry in here and I am really happy about that because I wasn't sure if you go to other sites and price these things out for this size you're not gonna get them at this price because I've bought one in the past and it was almost nine dollars I think seven or eight or nine dollars or something like that definitely wasn't what I just paid for those so that was an amazing deal let me turn this heater off um, okay, it's going off. So yeah, so this next item, this bag has, let's see what's in here. Oh, my old, you know, I'm not going to stop buying these until I get one for every bra that I own. <laughs> but I think I'm good now. I think this is about my fifth one maybe of these little bra bags. And I really like them. These were on Lightning Deal and I had to get a couple more because they're just such a good deal and they really do uh, protect my bras when I wash them so my goal is to get at least seven so I can have a week's worth of bras in its own uh, container once they get washed this item here this was something that I thought that I was going to use for my water bottles and I also tried to find a version of this at the Dollar Tree where I thought I could fit my water bottles in here but this one is even smaller than the one that I got at the Dollar Tree that didn't work either because the, the pockets were too small but I knew that when I got this one if it didn't work for my water bottles that I could also use it just to put um, underwears or bras in there to kind of free up my drawer space because that was a suggestion 
um, on how to use these, I believe, online. I, it kind of showed, I think, bras and underwears or, you know, that type of uh, <clears throat> that type of product to use in here. And it's pretty light, so it, it can't really handle anything too heavy. That's the other thing as I feel it. So I think probably underwear and bras would be the most practical thing to put in there. Now this item right here is something that you definitely want to have when you're trying to hang pictures or do something in a straight line and then it's that laser level and it works very well and what it is I thought this was going to come with um, a tripod but it didn't but you know you can just sit it up on something if you need to use it but it's a laser level and it has a level on it this way if you're trying to hang something this way there's a level if you're trying to hang something diagonal like that and then there's a level if you're trying to hang something just you know straight across this way depending on how you're using it what's great about this is it also has like a little mini six inch ruler right here on this side and then this side I believe it's centimeters 12 centimeters doesn't really say but I'm guessing that's what this is I know these are inches on this side so normally the other side is centimeters so that's what that looks like and then it has oh it has um, a tape measure at this end so you can pull it out and it's one of the good metal kind. Now I don't know how far this comes out, but I'm not going to test it. And then once you pull it, like when you pull it out, it's automatically, oh, look at that. <laughs> you pull it out. Oh, I was going to say it automatically stops, but I guess not. But you pull it out like this. You see how it automatically stopped right there? And then if you wanted to come back in, this button, you push that at the top and it goes back in now it goes I don't know sometimes it stays sometimes it's, so I think if you want it to stay maybe okay you mash it all right this has got me looking retarded par usual when I first got it and I pulled it out it would just stay open so it says pull what does that say yeah, it just says pull and then it says it in another language. So like right now when I pull it, it stays. And it stays. And it's, and then it doesn't. So I guess when you get to a certain length, it doesn't stay. Alright, I've wasted too much time. But when I what I thought it was, you pull it out, it stays, and then you mash the button, it retracts. So that part works, but it's just the initial pulling out doesn't unless there's a secret to when you pull it out that's what I need to figure out so reading is fundamental read your instructions but for the laser part um, it turns on this way and I don't know if you can see on my hand you can see the laser beam let me see if I can put it across my face you see that so it's like a cross it goes that way and this way depending on the direction you want to hang something I don't want to put it in my eyes but you can see see like that so that's how it works let me turn that off but yeah I thought this was really cool to have because this this will come in handy um, for many different projects you might work on and I like how the bottom is just sturdy and it looks like it's designed to where if you need it to like sit on some kind of a slot or something to keep it level then you could use it that way but it's a multi-purpose tool and I think I've pointed out all the different features of it we got the laser here the two rulers on either side the three levels and then the measuring tape and then this on the bottom and it also comes with additional batteries three additional batteries so that's pretty cool as well so I thought this was a great thing to have, especially when you're trying to hang something straight. Because whenever I try to wing it, it always ends up a little slant. It never, I never get anything just perfectly straight. So when I saw this, I'm like, I have to get it. And the price was definitely right. It was a really good deal. 
So I am happy with this. Let's just stick that back in here for now. And move on to the next thing. Anything else in here? Oh, yeah. So that is, what is this? So two things. Okay, so this thing right here was a cover or is a cover for the mop, like a little Swiffer mop. And it was supposed to be a pack of four. And I only received one. And my order clearly said four piece. So I only got one. So I called it in and they refunded me um, my money and said if you want to reorder it, you can. So, but yeah, I got this because you can wash them. And, you know, when you use those things, once you use it, it's a dirty. So you don't want to just keep reusing it without washing it. And this allows you, gives you some time before you get to washing it where you can just change them and put more on there. So that's why I wanted those. And I was kind of disappointed that I didn't get the four piece. But, you know, they gave me my money back. So if I want, I can just order it again. Now this is another perfume or yeah perfume that I bought that it's one of those Arabian ones. I had a cute bottle and I like the other one so much I said let me try uh, another scent. So this one I thought was kind of like a spray bottle because of how it looked. I knew it was going to be small. It's definitely tiny. Um, I thought I saw some glitter for a second. No, it was just little bubbles. But it's a cute little bottle like that. Very dainty and cute. Trying to see if you can get the design on there. It's so shiny I can't get it to... There you go. Isn't that cute? It's like a gold imprint. Very shiny little bottle. And then at the top it has the um, the stud. And then this one screws off like this. And it's a roller. I thought it was going to be a little spritzer. But it's a rolling. So it's another oil based. And you would just you know roll it on like that. And it smells. I believe this scent smells. I'm trying to see how much is coming out. Not a lot comes out. What I like about it is it kind of rubs it in as it goes on. And it smells really good. And it smells pretty much. I feel like it smells the same as the last one. Which I really liked. I do like it a lot. But I, it doesn't smell different to me. But it's nice. So to me it's just a different version. The last one I ordered it just had the little uh, glass like the glass what do you call it stick the glass dipper and you stick it in there and then you just rub it on that way but this one is the roll on but I feel like they are the same scent and it's really nice I really like it I'm not disappointed at all it smells really good and I like again that it's oil based and it's a cute little bottle so no disappointment here. I just have two versions of it. If it is different, I'll have to put them side by side and then test it out that way. But from what I'm remembering, this is the same scent. But I'm going to test it and see. And if it's not the same, it's just another nice one because I really like it. I like these oil-based um, perfumes. My brother who was in the military, he had uh, brought some back from his many travels. He's been overseas to many different countries and he brought a couple of oils back from my mother and it reminds me, that's what this reminds me of. It's not the same scent. His were nice as well but it just makes me think of, you know, it's the same idea, the oil based type perfume. So let me put these away and get to that other, another order. Oh wait! I have this box here that I didn't open. Hold on. See, I'm trying to be quick tonight because I got to go do my taxes. And I don't want to do them. So, let me open this box here. This thing got a little smush, would you say? <laughs> but I don't think it's going to be damaged. I bought this for 
Janae's side of the office because she needed some a little bit more storage over there and um, I saw this and I didn't measure so I'm hoping that it works I think it will now right off the bat I ordered it in white but this looks more like beige to me it's like an off-white so it doesn't really look white does that look white to you where's white let me get a white piece of paper a piece of paper that's white oh just trust me it's not okay let's see let's do this bag no, you can't tell. Never mind. It just looks off white though. But I was going to say it blends, but it definitely stands out that it's not white, white. And that's okay because it's going to be in a corner. So it's basically these four little shelves. And it's a four tier. And it comes with these four little feet <laughs> they're kind of cute okay and then the two handles are at the top I mean, you know how these things everything just sticks in to each other these cute little side poles like that and that's all that's in the box honey 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 must be Janae outside. Quiet. Yeah, Janae is home. Honey. Hold oh, on. Okay, this is what it looks like all put together. It's four tiers. And as you can see, oh, you can tell, look in uh, the shelf behind me. The shelf behind me is white. So you can kind of see how off-white it is. But it's four tiers. And it's pretty tall. The shelves are... They're not huge, but they'll hold some stuff. I don't want to knock anything down behind me. They'll hold some stuff. It's lightweight and everything just popped into each other. So very easy to put together. And then you just put it on the floor and it rolls. So hopefully this will fit... Janae's area that was her walking in which is why honey was going ham but um so yeah she can go ahead and test it out and let me know if it works for her okay so let's move on to the next item now this item is really cute I thought this was an amazing deal I couldn't believe that I got this deal for this price I can't remember which order it went in because I got them a little bit confused now. But this right here was a steal. Everything's a steal, but this was a super steal. And so cute. So cute. Look at this thing. And it's huge. So it's like this. And it's pink. I couldn't believe the price for this thing. So it is a little organizer for your makeup or for whatever you want to use it for. But they kind of advertise it for your makeup and toiletries. And look at how wide it is. It's pretty big. It's pretty big. And so I'm trying to hold it up and show you the features. So, oh, duh. So it has this handle right here. And then you can open it up like that and get access to the stuff on this side. Or you can open it on this side and have access to whatever you have on this side. And you see how tall it is. It can fit some pretty tall bottles in here. And then from the front, it has this drawer on the bottom which you can stick things in. And then these two drawers here. And they're pretty. Look at... Uh, because I can show you this way. They're pretty deep. They're pretty big drawers. They can hold quite a bit. It goes all the way from one side to the next. Hold on. Let me stick this in here. Okay. So yeah. So you get two of those drawers. And then this one. And then this one. Let's pull this one all the way out. So you can hold quite a bit of things. And it's portable. You can carry it around. So let's say you did use your daily day-to-day -day stuff. And you had it in here and you were sharing 
um, a bathroom or something with someone. You can just put it all in here and carry it with you if you needed to do it that way. But I like the fact that it opens on this side. Only one at a time, though. They both can't be open at the same time. But you still have access to everything. But I thought this was so cute and such a great deal. Can't beat it. And they had another, uh, they had two other versions. One that came in green and I believe white. I think it was white, green, and pink. And of course, you know I was going to go with the pink one. So I got one for myself and I got another one for Jenea because it was just such a good deal. I couldn't pass it up. <laughs> Okay, this next big ticket item, this was an amazing deal. Okay, you guys know I did, I did that mini stepper challenge, right? Well, if you didn't know, I did a 30-day mini stepper challenge. And I like that machine so much that I said, I want to order another one for a backup because if anything ever happened to the one that I have, I didn't want to be without one. And then I also... Uh, wanted to have another one in case Janae ever wanted to do it with me. We'd have two in the house. Plus, I'd have the backup. So, I kind of been watching them and monitoring them. And then I saw one for less than what I got the one that I have for now. And the one that I have was not from Timu. It was from another site. And it was, I think I paid $40 for that one. And that was a good deal at the time. But I've been watching the ones on Timu. And I saw one at this amazing price. And that's what's here. The box is empty because I got it right here. I'm going to show you. But this is what I ordered. This is the box that it came in. And I think this came from like a local warehouse. Because I got this before I got any of the other items that I ordered. Or either... It might have been its own order. It might have been its own order. And so that's what the box looks like. As you see, it's in good condition. It wasn't all smashed up or anything. And I was pleasantly surprised. And I got it rather quick, actually. But here's... And this is what it looks like. Let me just show you. Here's the actual stepper. Ooh, it's kind of heavy. So let's see. So it's nice. The only thing uh, that's different, it came with the the two um, bands that you can put on and to do your arms with. I can't talk right now. Is there a picture of them on here? Yeah. But it came with the stretch bands that you can uh, attach to the front here, to those front two holes right there, those loops. And then the front of it, the only difference is where that round black disc is. On the other ones, that's where they have the timer where you can clock your calories, your time, and your steps. So it doesn't come with that, but that's okay because I never use that on the other one. I just use my Apple Watch. But this, it's really smooth. I like it actually better than the first one that I got. And it comes with the same tools, a little wrench and a little bottle of oil to take care of it so I thought that was a great deal this is kind of a little bit heavy here so let me just try not to get my shirt all dirtied up okay so what I want to tell you about this is I ordered it and it came and when they delivered it it was delivered by uh, UPS and I knew the day that it was coming so and I could see on my ring camera when they dropped it off so after UPS left and I went to bring it in he brought two and I was like it, this is either a huge stepper that has to be put together which none of them really do they normally just come out of the box or they sent me two and I only ordered one so I, I went and brought it in and it was two separate boxes and I'm like they sent me two and they were both addressed to me and I'm like did they charge me for two of these things so I went and checked my order and it said just one. They only charged me one time. So I'm like, wow. So I called them immediately. I said, you guys, I ordered only one and you sent me two. I went on the online customer service thing. And I was chatting with them to let them know that I was, I received two, but I only ordered one. And so they were like, hold on, hold on. 
So they checked and they're like, okay, well, our apologies for the inconvenience. Since it was our mistake, feel free to keep it. I was like, wow, really? So I have three now and I only wanted a backup. So now Janae could have her own. I still have a backup plus the one that I ordered. So that was amazing. And I had to tell that story because, you know, Timu is just so many benefits to ordering from them. And that's just another one. They're so agreeable. Their, their customer service, you know, they really aim to please and keep you happy. And I honestly, I didn't want any smoke. So I said, let me just send this back because I don't want any problems. And that's why immediately, soon after I got it, I contacted them and they said, go ahead and keep it. Wow. So great story, great item, and um, great service. Had to share that one. So let's move on with the rest of these uh, products. Okay, what order are we on now? I think three or four. I don't know, but let's keep going because I need to get this stuff all and out of my office. So this is the next one. And there's some goodies packed in here. Let's see. There's that. Okay, so here is the third one that I told you about. So I'm not going to order this. That's another one of those. Excuse me. This is another one of those laundry baskets. So remember I said I want lights, darks, and delicate. That's this thing. So let's put this with the other one right here. Okay, you guys, I dropped this ring on the floor because all of my rings are feeling big now. Like, this is my big hand. <laughs> my big hand. This is the hand that has the, the, you know, bigger than the left hand. And the rings are falling off, like just sliding off. Especially on this one. This is the finger that I normally wear it on. This one just flung to the floor. So I'm going to put it on this one. Hopefully that won't happen again. Alright. Moving on. You don't care about that. Let's see what I got. Oh, okay. So these are... These are a few things for the kitchen. Why did I say it like that? For the kitchen. For the kitchen. Uh... I always wanted to get one of these egg separators like this and see if they work well. And because it was such an affordable price, I figured I'd give this one a try and see how well it works. It looks like it would work pretty good. So that's what that is. And, you know, pennies on the dollar. Okay, this is a two-piece set right here of those holders when you're taking out a plate from the microwave and you don't want it to burn your hand so they do like this so you can just reach in and grab it so you don't I would say normally your thumb possibly so you don't burn your thumb because sometimes when you pull things out it's hot in the microwave so I thought this is perfect. So I'm going to keep these right by my microwave. And they will be used because there are many times when I've pulled out a plate or a bowl and it has burned my hand. So I thought this was a great uh, idea to have. And they're silicone. So hopefully they will uh, absorb the majority of the heat that you might feel when pulling something out of the microwave. Now this item here... No, I have to laugh on this one because, again, on the website, it looked like it was a regular size popsicle container or maker. Now, I have some that are normally like the... Ooh, here we go again. I just dropped something. All right, so I have some that's the regular size one that are, you know, more just a round or just a square. And these look like r real popsicles with the lines and everything in it. See the lines that they have on it? So they look like the kind you would buy in the store. And it looked like that size that you would find in the store. But when I got it, I just had to laugh because I'm like, this is so tiny. And then 
this is what sticks on top and then it gives you the sticks now one of these just fell on the floor they stick in like that but I only see two of them here and I don't see where unless let me just check again hold on because I only saw two things on the floor yeah so I only see two of these but there's four here's the paper that it came in so unless those other ones flung somewhere I don't know what to say I can only do two at a time like that's crazy but anyways so there you have that and you saw it was sealed in plastic interesting so I'm stumped I'm stumped because even though they flew I know <laughs> that they didn't go past that like where are the other two so it looks like they're missing so let's move on so then I got this item now I have one of these already not this style but I wanted to get this style because it had um, the slots the individual slots like this so you can put actually put four on here and the one that I have now it doesn't have the individual slots but it has like a, a like a indentation to where you can stick them here and this one is a lot smaller than the one that I have now but I only got one because I wanted to see you know if I like this style better and um, from what I can see what I like about it again is the four distinctive slots for the four items so I think I'll be using this one a lot as well so that's for the kitchen and then they had these uh, bags that you would use if you want to if you have like a foot soak and you want to <clears throat> give your feet a nice little you know spa treatment then these bags would fit in the foot soak so that you don't have to like when you're done with it you can just take it out and throw it away you don't have to worry about cleaning your foot soak so they're basically liner bags for your foot soak and let's just see if I can pull one see if it's easy enough to open it up and pull one out to see how big they actually are okay I think there we go see they're all full so they're pretty thin but let me see I don't want to open them all the way too much and not be able to get them back in there but I just want to give you an idea of how big they really are so they're pretty big so they're gonna fit they're gonna fit a whole foot soak thing and I believe there's 20 in here so you can imagine how thin they are just looking at how easily this folds up like this which is why I don't want to pull it out but yeah so that's what these are they remind me again of those cafeteria worker gloves it feels kind of like they would be thin like those so they're definitely disposable and that's the whole idea so you can um, clean out your foot soak easily with these liners so I got those and then the last item in that envelope is this box like that light is kind of washing things out now this is an item that I passed over quite a few times and I every time I saw it I'm like I want to get that this is how it was packaged and I was like I want to get it I want to get it and I just kept passing it up till finally it came to the lowest price I've seen and I said let me go ahead and get it so it comes with this stand and then this little stone and it's just really cute and shiny and decorative. I don't want it to fall. Hold on. Let's do it like this. So there's the big diamond looking stone like that. And then here's the cute little stand. With the little dramatic, uh, what do you call this? The dramatic designs. 
Hold on, let's do like this. We have the dramatic little design like that. And it just sits, and it's like a cute little paperweight just to sit on your desk. And every time I saw it, they had other colors in the stone. They had red and blue, but I just like the, the white or the clear. And I just thought this was so cute. And I want to sit it on my desk and use it as a paperweight or just as, you know, a little desk decor. But it came nicely in the box, so very protective. So I have had that in my box for quite some time. And I'm like, I knew eventually I was going to order it. I just didn't know when. But I just think this is so cute, so pretty with the little stand in it. But you got to be careful. You don't want anybody to knock it over and break it. Then you'll be pissed. So let's stick it back in here for now. Just to be safe. Until I put it in its new uh, final home. Okay, so this is what was in this uh, envelope for this order. And let's see what was in the other one. Something heavy in here. Let's see. Oh, okay. I remember we got a couple of clothing items in here. And other things. Let's see. I don't remember what. Oh, yes, I do. Okay. Alright, this is what was heavy in here. Okay, so the first thing. Let's do the heavy one last. First thing I got were these um, reusable pads, and I thought that these were a nice idea. Instead of purchasing little daily, you know, liners, to just buy a pack that you can use and, you know, just wash and reuse them. So this is a pack of, let's see, five I think, and they're all different patterns. So there's that, that, look at this one, it's really cute, and pink, this one's cute, not so much my color scheme, but, and then this one's nice with the butterflies, and then they just, you know, they all look like this on the other side, they uh, have the snaps, you just put it around your panties, and just snap it on like that. And you can snap it in two places. You can do that one or you can do this one. Depending on, I guess, the coverage that you would like to get. And then also, you can take them and fold them up like this. One this way or... Let me see if I can get it. Okay. This way. One this way. One this way. Like that. And this is how you would carry them around. And then one this way. Wait a minute. <laughs> one this way. This one right here. Like that. And then you fold it over and you snap it. And it's like a little envelope. So no one really knows what it is. And you can carry it in your purse or in your gym bag in your car and then when you need to use it you just unsnap it and then turn it around like that and then this is the area you know that provides you the protection so i thought that these were neat now i have ordered some more i haven't hauled them yet because i have to find them um i discovered that i have two boxes over here i never even hauled from early on so I'm trying to make my way to those items um, I don't even know I can't even tell you they were some of my first orders and I guess I got so behind I started moving and rearranging things trying to stay organized and I put them in these boxes in these teeny boxes and they just been sitting there and I thought they were empty and they're actually full of stuff so I think that's where my other ones are so, but that's what these are, these reusable pads. And these are great. I'm, I think this is a great idea that they came out with those, that you can just use them, wash them, and then reuse them. Okay, this item right here, let's see what this is, because I honestly, oh, 
I do know. These are more, um, more panties. More, what do you call these? What do they call them? Well, it's on the screen, but these are the ones that are not waterproof. But whatever they call them, these look bigger than the other ones I've ordered. But they have the parts here that leak proof. That's what I'm trying to think. They're leak proof panties. So they have the parts here that, you know, just a little dribble, not no whole pint or gallon or anything like that. But if you just have a little dribble, a little spill, then it won't leak through your underwear. Now, this is a different vendor. And these look bigger than the other ones but i don't mind because i like i'd like all of my stuff comfortable on me so if they fit or if they're too big i'm okay but it comes in the black and the gray pair and then the maroon or the burgundy pair so you get three pairs of those i like these underwear so this is i think my third time ordering them and each set the first set I think I got four and then the second set was three like this I think this was the same I think this was the same set that I ordered before but they look a little different like they look bigger to me um, so this is a set of three so now that makes three three and four so that's ten pairs that I have and I do like these I wear them all the time I don't even wear my other underwear anymore I just wear these okay so then from there we have and i don't normally order clothing type items so i saw these and i thought you know these would be fun little things to wear and try some of their clothes and this is a little pajama set because it's about to get hot and it gets hot in this house so I need to be comfortable when I go to bed. Not trying to be cute or sexy. I just need to be comfortable and cool. So I saw these and I thought this is perfect. This will be perfect and it's nice. And I know a lot of the Timu uh, material is thin. So this is ideal because out here in the summertime is sweltering. And this house gets hot. And... um so these are going to be perfect and i thought they were cute so it's a little pants that says love and then the little top to go with it and um yeah i am definitely going to be using these because it's either this or walking around with a t-shirt and your underwear on so i'd like to be a little bit more civilized than that and wear a little cute set so this was my tester to see um if I would like a uh, Timu little outfits or something. So we'll see. Along those lines, actually, I'll show you this one for the same reason. So remember I said it's either that or a t-shirt. T-shirt and, and my panties on or some uh, civilized clothes. Well, this along the same lines. It's a thin little gown that uh, has little eyelashes. It says like, baby. This says baby. And it's a very lightweight little gown to wear to bed so that I'm not burning up come summertime. This one actually feels a little thicker than those, but it's still light and thin. So I just, I saw these and I'm like, and they're having a lot of sales on these. So now is the time to buy this stuff for the summer if you, like me, are going to need some cool pajama alternatives in the summer because I do still like to wear pajamas I just don't want to be walking around in just some raggedy t-shirts and stuff so those are two nice options now this is a bag that it's for bananas I don't know that it works but I want to give it a try because the last item that I ordered along this line was the one for baked potatoes and it says you can cook a baked potato in four minutes and that thing really works so i said well let me try the banana bag and it's just it looks like this kind of like a freezer bag and it has the drawstring and it just says bananas on the front and it's supposed to make them last longer and not over ripen too fast 
So I'm looking forward to giving this a try. I did buy some bananas, but I didn't haul this prior. So I haven't been able to test and see if it works yet. And the bananas that I have in there, I think, have already kind of ripened. So I'll have to wait till I buy some more bananas, try this out, and then I'll let you guys know how I like that. And then the last thing in here that was so heavy, this was a great price. This is a two-piece little lounge set. And this, again, just something for me to wear around the house, me and Janae, while we're just kicking it, sitting around. So I didn't order it yet, so I'm excited to see. Um, and white was the color that was on special, or else I would have never got white, because white is definitely not going to stay clean. But it's a cute little, like a little midriff shirt. Did I block the, okay, it's a cute little midriff type shirt. Like that, just plain white, long sleeve. And then it has the matching pants, like this. And at the bottom is the cinched leg at the bottom. This feels really soft. I bet you, let's see, we know it's polyester, but let's just see. Let me see. Where is it? Let's try on the shirt. It feels very comfortable though. And like I say, it's heavy. It has some weight to it. Where would I find the tag on this thing? It's got to be here somewhere. Oh, here it is. Oh, okay. So it says, and it's an extra, extra large. Okay. And it says... 95% polyester, 5% elastane. So, not 100%, but almost. But it's cute, though. Look at it. It's a cute little midriff top that's not going to be too ridiculous. Perfect for walking around the house. If my stomach is hanging out on this, nobody's going to see it but me. So, <laughs> And then it's just, you know, elastic. And, does it, and it has pockets. It has little pockets on the side. I wish I could have got it in another color. I think this ended up, after all the price adjustments, I think I ended up getting this for, I think it was like $5.03. But again, I would have been cool if I could have got one of the other colors, like black or pink or any other color than white. But like I said, just for wearing it around the house, it's perfect for that. And I'm not going to try to, you know, it's not an outfit to wear somewhere. It's just, again, lounging around the house. But doing it, you know, in some clothes that look decent instead of looking like I just cleaned out the garage or something. Or wearing clothes that need to be thrown in the trash. I'm trying to upgrade my life. <laughs> so let's move on to, let's see if we can clear out these last two orders. Let's see if you're still hanging with me. Let's keep it going. I'll be right back. This is actually my last order. I thought I had two more, but this is the last one, and this is probably the biggest one. Oops. Look at this. I forgot what's in here to make it so long, but wow. Let's go ahead and knock it out. I'm excited. I After this one, I'm all caught up, so let's get caught up. Okay, let's see. Let's be careful because I don't know. I can't remember everything that's in here. It's falling out already. Oh, okay. That's funny. I do remember now. So I don't think this one will take too, too long. Let's see. I can pull it out carefully. Okay, so there's that big old long bag. Gone. Okay, I'm going to have to dig my way out of all this stuff. Okay, so the first thing, let's get to these right here. The first thing is this. This is a, I ordered a tripod the last time and I liked it a lot. Because it was replacing one that I take to the gym with me when I go work out. And I wanted to duplicate that one. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Let's see. Something else fell. Okay. 
All right. These two items fell out of the box because I had them at the top, I guess. So I wanted to duplicate the one that I got. And I opened this already and it's not that one. I'm not really happy with this one. I do feel like I want to return it, but the price was so affordable. So I'm thinking maybe I'll just use it some way around the house but it's just a tripod it's not it's not one of the ones that i could just slide open which is why i don't like it this is one of the ones where you gotta untwist this slide it out twist it back tighten it up on you know tighten untighten even down here tighten untighten and i don't want to go through all that i just want one that just slides out like the last one that i ordered and i thought this would be that but it's not so this is something that either I'm going to send back or I'm just going to find a permanent use where I can just set it up and just use it as is. But that's what this is. And um, like I said, it's, it's, it's not the kind that I thought I could walk around and just hold my camera like this. This is totally not what I thought it would be. It was a good price, but again, not what I was expecting. So... Um, the, I'm on the fence. The jury's still out on this one on whether or not I'm going to keep it. But I just wanted to share with you in case you guys were contemplating a tripod and wanted to know, you know, what one might look like. So that's that. Sit that here. Okay, and then what is this? Oh, oh, oh. Let me show you that next because it's going to make more sense after I show you another item. So these items were cute little containers. I was excited about these because, again, you know, I'm doing all of my organizing and rearranging and whatnot, you know, in my bathroom and throughout the house. I bought these to put in my bathroom. However, they're a little too small, but they're the right look, but they're a little too small. And so I'm not sure I'm going to use them there because if I use them where I wanted to use them, it's, I'm going to lose space and I need the slot to be like, I need this basket to fit the size of the slot and this is too small. So if I only use this basket in that slot, then I can't fit the same amount of stuff in there that I have now. So that's why I'm thinking they won't work. But these have dropped in price. I just saw them today, today for 98 cents. Great, great price. Now, I'm pretty sure I got price adjusted down to that. But when I ordered them originally, they were not at 98 cents. And, you know, they're nice. They're cute. They're, they got the look. They got the little handles. You know, just for putting light stuff in. It would have worked great for me had they been the right... Um, size but you know they're not going to work for that area but I can find another area and I did end up ordering three of these because I had three slots that I needed them to go into so that's why I ordered three but they're not going to go to waste um, I like the acrylic see-through type of storage so I'm definitely going to uh, find a use for these now the next item is I thought I was still waiting for this one but I got uh, my final lamp. I believe this is my final candle warmer lamp. And it's a, it's one that I ordered already. I'm just going to show you really quickly what it is. I think, is this my final one? Which one is this one? Let me see because, yeah. Is it my final one? I think it is. I think it is. I've ordered so many of these now. I've got. I'm confused. Let's see which one this is. And I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> yeah, this is okay. So that's this one. And so I ordered one. This is what happened. Wait, what happened? What's the story behind this one? There is a story. Okay, I do remember now. This one, and I really like this one. I didn't think I would like this one. I got one for pretty much every room in this house. 
because I like them that much. So this is the one that um, is the little triangle shaped one like that. And I have the other one set up in my haul, which I'll try to insert a picture like I always do of my actual one in action. Um, but when I when I ordered this, I'm like, I don't know if I'm going to like this one. It looks small, the shape, etc. Just didn't look the same as the other ones. But I really like it. And where I have it set up looks really nice. But here's the story on this one. So I ordered this one and it was on special. I think it was like $10 and something. Ten sixty, ten fifty, something like that. Ten night, somewhere a little over ten dollars when I first ordered it. And you know, I do my price adjustments on a regular after I place an order. So I always check my price adjustments, and I saw that this lamp <laughs> went down to eight dollars and fifty six cents, something like that. And I'm like, wow. So I went to do. A price adjustment let me see if I get the story right now I went to do a price okay this is what happened so I had this I ordered it for 10 okay a little over 10 and then I saw it for 856 and I was like ooh that is a great price I'm gonna get an I'm gonna I'll order it for the 856 because I wanted one more and at that price I couldn't resist and then I said, and then I'm going to get a price adjustment because I just ordered it for over 10. So I placed the order and then I went to do the price adjustment. And when I went in to do the price adjustment, because I said I saw it for a lesser price, it told me that I needed not price adjustment like a, I did. I went to do a what did I do? It was a price adjustment. I'm pretty positive. So when I went in to do the price adjustment, I can't remember where I went into, but what I'm trying to get to is they told me wherever I was, they said I had to, I had to prove, like I had to show the like item. I had to show the like item and have proof of it or something like that. So I went back to the listing where I saw it for 856 and it was gone. I'm trying to figure out though what led me to that situation. Cuz if I was I think it was the I might have done tried to do like a return or something. Maybe it was, it was somewhere where I I got to this area where it said if you want us to give you the difference, you have to prove you have to provide proof that it's the same item and you have to give a picture of it and prove that it's the same item. So I was like, okay, because I saw it on Timu.com. So I went back to right where I had ordered it. And every time I, I opened up the listing, it came up for like, night, or it was either 19 or $24. So that $8.56 listing just disappeared. And I'm like, I know you're not trying to play me, Timu. So because I ordered it, I was able to prove that it was 856. So had I not placed the order for the second one before that happened, then I would have there would have been no way for me to show that this was eight dollars and fifty six cents. I think this was the one because I got all my orders mixed up now. But because I had ordered it when I saw it at eight fifty six then I took a screenshot of my order form and said here's your proof that this very lamp that I ordered already was eight dollars and fifty six cents so then once that happened they immediately just gave me the adjustment I wasn't working with a person I was working with like just the online version which sometimes I feel like there's no real person or nobody who really checks they just want you to provide stuff but they tried to pull a fast one on me, which is the, the moral of the story. If I hadn't ordered it first, they took away all those that $8 uh, evidence and made it look like I was crazy. But if I hadn't ordered it and placed that order for that amount, then they would have been able to get away with it. And I wouldn't have been able to get the difference 
um, in the refund on the original one that I had ordered for 10 They both were a great price, but I was like, Timo is trying to be slick. Stop it. Stop it. So anyways, moral of the story is if you see something like that, snap a picture on your phone. You don't have to order it like I did, but snap a picture if you ordered something already and it was more and you saw it for less, just as a safeguard. Hopefully that made sense to somebody. But anyways, I really like this one and the one that I bought previously, I have it set up right now and like I said, I'll put a picture of it in there. I really like how it looks. I, I thought I wouldn't like the, the top of it because it just seems small. But I like all of them. They're all really nice. And I think I'm good now. I don't think I need to order anymore. And having said that, for this order, this was an item I said I would hold off and haul because it would make more sense after I showed you this. So now that you see this, I have two of these. I have two of the the column, circu the circular one that's kind of like a square circle. Not a square circle. But it's like a circular one, but thick. I have two of those, two of these, and two of the glass ones. The amber glass. Now, this item right here will make sense to you now. Even though they all come with two bulbs, uh, my amber one ran out of bulb. I mean, one of the bulbs uh, ran out already. So I bought some more backup bulb so I ha I'm not out of any of the ones that they've come with like I said I have 10 well what did I say I have six of them one two three four five six so I have 12 bulbs one has already blown out so with the way that I use them I'm trying to use them on a timer now because this one comes with a timer where you can set it to two four and six hours and the, or you can just leave it on all day. My amber one has a timer, so I use that now instead of just leaving it on all the time because I like them that much. They just keep the candles, the scent of the candles, you know, just permeating throughout your home. And I just like how that, you know, how that works. So, but now I kind of set them on a timer because the scent, you know, will carry for a while after that you turn them off. But I don't want to go through my bulbs too fast because I saw how I already went through one of the amber bulbs. So I got the second one in there and then I've got uh, backups. So I said, you know what, just to be safe, let me order some bulbs. So when I use all of those up, I still will have some to go, you know, to replace them with. So hopefully that makes sense. But yeah, having said all that to say that. Um, and then you see they come with the two bulbs like right here like there's nothing in here now So I'm trying to make sure that I don't overuse them, but I like them. They're just so They're so cute and they make a space. They just elevate the look of a space and um, And then to have all your candles last longer and look decorative. It's like you can't you can't beat it you just can't beat it so I got all of mine at great prices I really feel like I got six candle warmers probably for a little over what people pay for one so literally I got four of them for ten dollars so that's forty bucks right there so you know in other places they're charging 40 bucks for one and then the other the two amber ones I got for uh, how much were those those were 12 12 64 I think so another great price for the glass and you know glassy more elegant look but yeah I'm just really happy with these things so I got my extra bulbs they all came with an extra bulb so I'm good for a minute um, but let's see is this it this is the last bag and i think we're done so let's um push this over here and see what remains and it's only one item in here oh and it's another t-shirt <laughs> and guess what which t-shirt i forgot i ordered this one guess which t-shirt this is 
I'm going to give you three seconds. One 1,000, two 1,000, three 1,000. All right. This is what it is. <laughs> it's another melanin t-shirt. But it's different though. Let's see. Let me do it this way. Can you see it? There we go. It's like dripping melanin. Versus this one. This one doesn't have that at the bottom. Yeah, this one is just the bars. That's so funny. I didn't realize they were actually different. I thought they were the same. But this one, you can hardly see the word melanin like at first glance. You can see it better on the camera than in person. And then again, it has the drips. And this color they call apricot. So it's not like beige or white or bone. So yeah, I kind of forgot all about this one. That's why I'm like, I need to get, and this actually goes better with this headband than the one that I'm wearing now. But what you gonna do? Well, we know this is polyester. And it's XXL. 99% per, 99 polyester. Oh, 95% polyester, 5% elastine. This one actually feels a lot like cotton. How did they do that? This really feels like a t-shirt material, even though it's not. This is polyester. It's so amazing to me how they get this material to feel like that. I'm glad it feels like this instead of the old school polyester that nobody wanted to wear. Um... So yeah, that's everything, you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. <laughs> um, I am all caught up on my recent orders. I do have these older ones I mentioned, so I need to make my way towards those. Hopefully I can get to those next weekend and knock those out. Is that a... Oh, okay, yeah, I saw a box there. I'm like, is that some more? Yeah, we're good. We are good. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you enjoyed some of these amazing items. Far too many for me to try and do a recap. I normally like to recap, but we're not doing that today. Um, it's just too much stuff. But I'm happy to have finally shared that with you and shared all these different stories with you of my Timu adventures. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And the links to everything will be in the description box and in the first pinned comment so long as they're still available and not sold out. And if you are interested in purchasing any of these items, please use my discount code of OPT43129 so that you can save 30% off if this is your first order. Um, I always say whether it's your first order or not, just put the code in there just on the off chance that Maybe you, everybody will save 30%. Maybe only the first time people will save it. But just put the code in there on the off chance you might save. You're going to save anyways if you're ordering on Timu because the prices are just so doggone reasonable. And if you're like me, if you're a bargain hunter, you can find some great deals on Timu. And that's why I like to share with you guys what I find because... It becomes a challenge to just, I get excited when I get a good deal. I don't mind spending money if it's a good deal. And I get excited when I get good deals on Timu. So, and I just love to share them with you guys. So on that note, I'm going to close this video out and say goodbye. I'll see you in the next one. You guys take care and be safe out there and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>